All right, we're back from soccer. How was your game, Gray? Perf perfect. Did you guys win or did you lose? We won. By how many points? Only one. One point. Grayson did so good. He, he had an assist. He passed it to his teammate and they scored the goal. And Porter, how was your game? My, my game was scratching. And, and I, I cracked, I cracked, I flipped over someone and that will hurt. Now Porter scored a ton of goals. He kept shooting it and scoring and scoring and scoring and scoring. Yeah, the shark's good. Even I'm scared. He was a shark. They played sharks and minnows, and he was a shark at one point, huh? And then here's little Avery. Little Avery. It's too cold, so Avery stayed home with Dad, huh? Say both the boys. But maybe when it gets warmer, she'll come to some of the games. Say both. The boys' games were awesome. Yeah, both of you boys had awesome games. Yeah, and I'll seven on my game. You smell. Did you go poop again? Do we need to change your diaper? I'm the best game. <laughs> hey, baby, what are you doing? Are we outside? Boys are playing on the slide. We are out here enjoying the awesome spring weather. It's finally getting warm. It's supposed to be a high of 75 today. I'm wearing jeans, but I <laughs> might need to change the shorts. It's already really hot and it's really sunny. I don't know where the sun is. But today is a special day. It's Monday. Gray would normally be in school, but school is canceled for the solar eclipse. So where we live in Ohio, we are actually right in the path of 100% totality. Be jealous. So like starting at like 2, it starts like partially becoming the eclipse. And then at like 3 o'clock, we get like one minute where we are of like totality where it's going to get pitch dark. And then it's over by like 4.30. I guess there's other cities like Cleveland or Dallas where they're gonna get like up to four minutes of like total darkness. But where we are, we're like just barely in the past. So we just get one minute of it. Basically, if you don't know an eclipse, I don't really know that much about it, but it's like the moon blocks the sun during the day. So instead of it being light during daytime, it's gonna be dark like night. So, and then we have these special glasses that we got for free so we can look at the sun because you're not supposed to look at it with your bare eyes. Otherwise, it will cause damage. So, I don't know if I'm going to have the kids out here when that happens because I don't want them to get their eyes damaged. But we do have glasses for them if they want to watch but, it. But said that you're electro. Okay, after I video. So, we're just out here for now. It's like noon, 12.30. So it'll all, all start happening in like a little over an hour. Yeah. People are like traveling all to like all parts of Ohio. Well, I guess the parts that are in the path of totality. Um, they had signs. We went on the highway this past weekend and they had signs saying like no parking on the berm during the eclipse. And people were like roping off their driveways and their farms because I, I guess that's where people like to go is just a big empty field where there's nothing like blocking the view of the sun. So people are like blocking off so people can't be there. And I don't know, it just sounds kind of crazy to me to do all that stuff. But we are just um, not going anywhere because we're in the path of totality and we're just gonna come out and look up. <laughs> Anthony's working today. But uh, a lot of people called off work, no school, because the school didn't want the liability of all the kids um, looking up at the sun, which I don't blame them. And my sister actually had the day off of school for the eclipse, so I have no ivy today. So just the kids, and we're just kind of enjoying this really nice weather. It's just been cold, 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 and finally we're getting into the warm weather. I hope it stays, but knowing Ohio, we'll probably get some more chilly days here and there. But this is making me very excited for summer. It's very getting warm. 
I think my mom is gonna come over. We have an extra pair of glasses, so she was gonna use them. And where she lives in Columbus, she's What's not this? in the path of totality, but where we are, we are, or we what would be in the this? path. So I think she's gonna come here and see it. I'll video a little bit. I think you're not supposed to point your your lens at the sun because it could damage it. I know that's for professional cameras. I'm not sure about iPhones. So maybe I'll just like video like the surroundings getting dark. So yeah, we'll see what we see, but it's like once in a lifetime event. They said the next solar eclipse that will happen like here in Ohio will be like 2099. So I probably won't be alive for that. Um, my kids will be, that's like 75 years from now, but I will probably be dead. <laughs> so gotta see it. Back in 2017, we had it an eclipse here, but it wasn't a total eclipse. It was just a partial. So now we are in the path of totality. So let me know down below. Did you see the eclipse? Were you in the path of totality? We are the kind of people where like, if we're in the path, great, we'll look at it. And if we're not, we're not going to go and travel. I guess hotels have been charging like up to a thousand dollars a night for people to stay like in the path I and the they seed. say traffic is going to be hours long and i, I planted the seed yeah we're just enjoying the nice weather and Mama. yeah i'll bring the camera out when it gets a little Mama. closer yes Mama. yes porter you want me to get it out for you yeah and we get it here okay i'm gonna put my knob Spooky. Three twelve. Uh, oh, yeah, I am. That is cool. Yeah, it's it's it looks you can like see it so much it's better. Over there. It's like you can't like it's coming. Yeah. See it? Oh. Yeah, this guy's lighter, that guy's dark. Yeah. yeah. See it's light over there.